Hello everyone, I'm SV and I'd like to introduce you my new product. I'm in Cinema 4D and I start to change my settings. FPC for 24, then uh, render settings for redshift like usually and basic I will change for 32 passes only. For a moment only like this. So, uh, I like to introduce you new materials. You can check link below this video and you can find new materials. Redshift Ocean SV. So, inside you can find two folders, C and Sky. Please check link below this video and if you like it, you can download. So, you have eight materials total nine materials for C and you have eight materials for uh, sky, four materials daylight and four materials night. So I show you now how to make a easy settings with this material. And uh, if you like this video, you can go and check link below the video. And if you like, you can purchase it. Okay, so what we will do. Uh, first of all, I create a disk disk will be with following settings. I created 10,000 and 50. For this disk I will apply redshift object tag and geometry I will make a 70 and 40. So uh, on the link below you can find more interesting tutorial about how to create this material. For a moment I just show you final result. So after that I create a hemisphere uh, with following settings. It will be 10,000 also and it will be hemisphere, only half. Okay, I have some settings. So I am going for my pack. Again, I repeat, you can check link below. Uh, and for a moment, for, for example, I take a C force number four. It is accordance to, I, uh, it is accordance to C international scale, yeah? Okay, and I take, for example, Mm, night material this, night number one. Okay, so what I'll do. Apply C for disk, apply sky for sphere. Push render and check result. Just moment, wait a little bit. Okay, I have like this result. Looks like, looks like interesting, yeah? As for me. Before start, you see it's very bright uh, because I haven't any uh, light. To receive a more correct result, I have to go to Redshift, Integration and disable the defi default light. So now I will get a more interesting result. Very good. Okay, so uh, you can see a very nice C. It's all these materials is animated. Yeah, you can check it. So I, I check it. Yeah, every frames you have some moving. You see some moving of these materials and it really looks like very nice. So how to create a moon? We are create a sphere. For oh sorry, not not sphere, not sphere, my mistake. We are create a light, area light. And this area light will be with following settings. First of all, it will be sphere. Uh, it will be really very big radius. Maybe something like that. Okay, and for texture, for texture pass here, I will apply. You can download it from, uh, I don't know, from internet somewhere I have in my database. Also on the link below, you can find this texture. I'll take texture somewhere planet. Where is this my planets? And moon, mm -hmm. moon, okay, like this. So I have it. Very nice. What we will do now? Somewhere here I set up a camera. So this will be my camera. Now I take my sphere. You see this is my sphere. And I push the sphere somewhere here. Maybe something like that. Okay, on top. Yeah, somewhere here will be my sphere. Very good. So, uh, Next settings, it should be visible. It's very important. So render and check what I get. 
we have to wait a little bit. Yeah, you see, looks like very, very nice. Yes, maybe I'll put the sphere a little bit down. Okay and you can see very beautiful picture so and now i play a little bit with the sphere first of all i increase the intensity of the sphere for maybe 25. oh no it's too much maybe 10 only okay maybe like this maybe two we will see now now we will find some nice result okay very good also you can change uh, some color maybe just little bit yellow to give some temperature okay so maybe maybe five i don't know okay maybe like this this will be really very bright yeah additionally if you don't like uh for example um, for example diffuse you can reduce or glossiness or something it's up to you you can play how you like yeah so maybe diffuse color will be only 0 0.5 and all other I will use a maximum. Okay, so I like it. If I like to receive some glow around, what I'll do, I just take my sphere and, oh, sorry, sorry. I block this result. Come on. Yes, it is blocked. Okay going here okay if i like to receive some glow around i just make over uh, overwriting this small sphere with this big hemisphere as you can see as closer as i'm moving i get some very interesting result yeah so as for me it's very very interesting picture maybe just a little bit on top something like that okay so uh, how to create a daylight how to create for example daylight uh, so i don't need any more this moon light mm, i going for my material pack again which you can find below this video i take a uh, red shift sky and i take i don't know any daylight maybe day number two doesn't matter and also i take other c for example i like to receive uh, some climb c number two force only number two okay so take this uh, sorry take c number two over right here take day light over right here render and check result so now okay not here here we will check wait a little bit preparation really rendering coming very fast you see we have very climb c and we have some daylights okay maybe like this i'll check it okay you see yeah how, how it can be this clouds is very very high okay very nice maybe i just little bit change angle maybe like this and what i get now okay so i like it now i will put a sum again i create a area light and this area light will be not by color this area light will be by temperature okay temperature of sun about like this i mean color of sun so again we are going down it will be sphere with following settings it will be thousand 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 and of course it will be visible yeah okay so i have some sun which is now inside in the water so i block it here maybe just a little bit reduce and again yeah create new camera where is this my camera here yeah take my sun and pull somewhere here you see on the horizon line yeah little bit pick up maybe in this area okay again if i like to receive some glow around the sun i just make a overwriting so i just push it closer you see glow smaller or far this glow coming a little bit more somewhere here it will be really nice result okay so what i like to receive more 
to increase intensity, maybe 25, just to receive something like this result. Or maybe 15, it's up to you, completely up to you what you like, or maybe 15. And maybe pick up a little bit more. And you can see, it looks like very nice and very photorealistic, as for me. Again, we can go to Material Browser, uh, we can find this Redshift Ocean SV, and for example, yeah, for example, I change for this day number one or day number four or night number, I don't know, number three, doesn't matter. So, and what I will get, uh, change day number four, just push here and you can see the result. You can see final result, how it will be, you see this glow how it's coming yeah you can change for example for date number one doesn't matter yeah you see some clouds and you will get very beautiful very nice final result you can change a uh, C change and you can see the C already very roughness so uh, I hope you like this my tutorial today I show it you how to create a Sun and how to create a moon uh, especially for my this material pack check link below thank you for watching please share to your friends put like and see you next time goodbye my friends